Okay, so the uh, the clip of, uh, you know, I was talking about the uh, xenophobia, the Islamophobia, the misogyny, the homophobia, uh, you know, uh, plagiarism by Melania Trump. Uh, Melania Trump was the least of the things that offended me in last night. In fact, it didn't offend me, frankly, at all. It, it's 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 you know, it's a it's a self-inflicted wound, or it's a wound inflicted by somebody in the Trump campaign. And since nobody's been fired, I'm guessing it's one of Trump's uh, three kids. But who knows? I mean, this is just my guessing. But the 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 rest of what happened last night was just offensive to me. And I, I and frankly, I think it was even so over the top. I, you know, I was channel flipping back and forth between MSNBC, CNN and Fox. And uh, Fox didn't actually carry most of the speakers. They had they had, you know, hosts on talking about things. And well, actually, Fox now has two channels. I somehow I discovered a second Fox channel, Fox Headline News. And, and I watched that for a while thinking it was the Fox channel and it turned there next door to each other on our on our phone or on our uh, on our uh, cable TV system. But anyhow, it, it, it reminded me of 1964. Nelson Rockefeller, it, you know, Barry Goldwater famously gave the speech, you know, extremism in the pursuit of in the defense of liberty is no vice. Right. Uh, and and moderation is no virtue. And uh, that followed this. This was this was Nelson Rockefeller, who was running against Barry Goldwater for the for the nomination for president of the United States on the Republican ticket in 1964. Nelson Rockefeller re representing the the uh, the Main Street wing of the party and even arguably the Wall Street wing of the party and Barry Goldwater representing the the hard right uh modern day Donald Trump wing of the party, I guess. I, you know, but here's what Nelson Rockefeller had to say. These extremists feed on fear, hate, and terror. They encourage disunity. Now, he was booed. I don't know if you heard that, but he was booed. Because the extremist he was speaking of, there was Barry Goldwater and his buddies. And let me just do one more time. This is Nelson Rockefeller talking about his other Republicans. Now, you're not hearing other Republicans like Nelson Rockefeller in the party anymore, but here, here he was in 1964. These extremists feed on fear, hate, and terror. They encourage disunity. And they encourage disunity. Well, now it's fear, hate, and terror with unity. You know, yes, we all hate gay people. We all hate Muslims. We all hate... Uh, Democrats, we all think Hillary should be, you know, and, and on and on it goes. And it's just, it's reached the point now, I think, where the Republican Party um, has become essentially a caricature of itself. It's no longer a political party. It's, it's, a, it's a marketing machine for, for hate. I don't know how else to describe it. You look at the, at the platform and everything else, it's bizarre. To watch more clips from our programs, hit the Watch More Videos button over here. And please be sure to hit the handy-dandy subscribe button so you'll always be up to date. Tag, you're it.